I'm going to the police academy. That's the Citizens Police Academy, Lance. That's even better. Let's go! King Brothers Used Cars in Winchester has a huge selection of Fords, Chevys, Jeeps, and more. Come by and see why people have been choosing King Brothers for over 50 years or visit kingbrotherscars.com. Family owned and time tested since 1966. Brenda along with WBON TV and I am passing on the torch of Citizens Police Academy. I'm yeah. here with Lance the Lawman Gaither. Tell us about your first night at Citizens Police Academy. Well, they didn't do much the first night. They just kind of, it was an introduction. Of course, they had pizza there, thanks to a certain someone who I won't name. They uh, introduced us to all that the police. Me. You, can, you can mention me. Yes, I it brought was thanks the to pizza. Grindelin. Grindelin <laughs> brought the pizza. You're welcome. It was good pizza. And uh, so we just met all the cops who were going to be meeting throughout the week, or uh, throughout the 11 weeks. And they just talked about what's going on. I think it's going to be a really fun 11 weeks. It looks like there's a lot of cool stuff going on. I mean, honestly, I'm so excited for you to go through this because I had so much fun with this. There's so many different activities and everything that you're going to progress through for the 11 weeks that you're there. You've looked at the schedule and you've kind of seen what's going to happen. Have you kind of been eyeing a certain week like that is looking to be the most interesting for you? Uh, probably the active shooter simulation training is the one I'm most looking forward to. It's, uh, it, I mean, it'll pretty much just be like a video game except in real life almost. Yeah. So I'm expecting that to be really fun. Now there's two of those. There's an actual simulator where you go in and you have a gun and you're like put into different scenarios. And then there's an active shooter scenario where you actually go to a school and the um, special response unit is there and they teach you how they would enter this, the school and all kinds of different. So you're actually talking about two different things. So those will both be very interesting. Um, when I was there, have, have you been to jail? I've never been arrested. That was an interesting way to answer that question. But that being said, I really enjoyed the tour that we got to take at the detention center. It's really interesting to kind of go in and see the, the workings of it. Another one of my favorite um, segments was, it was very difficult, but the coroner comes in and speaks to you and kind of tells about some of the things that he does that you might not expect. So those are a couple of things that I really enjoyed. Um, any thoughts from last night? Uh I'm just really looking forward to it. The coroner thing, I don't know how I feel about that. That is kind of a dead-end job for him to work, so. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> but I think that'll be fun, too. Uh, actually, fun fact about me, when I was probably about 14 or 13, I actually was thinking I was wanting to be a mortician when I grew up, which, of course, I'm not going to become a mortician, so. Maybe you missed your calling. Maybe. But, again, it was a dead-end job, so I decided against it and picked journalism. Done, done. Done. <laughs> That's twice in five minutes. All right. Um, so obviously Lance is going to have a little bit of a different take on it than what you saw last year when I went through the Citizens Police Academy. I think we're going to look for some fun segments with you and uh, some entertainment along the way. All right. So uh, stay tuned because we're going to have a lot of fun this week. We've got 11 weeks to look forward to at Citizens Police Academy with Lance the Lawman Gaither. Stay tuned for lots more fun. It's going to be great, y'all.